chapter 28 Monte Carlo analysis to assign the tolerance value to the components in order to perform the Monte Carlo analysis. Now what's a Monte Carlo analysis? Now, we know that uh, in the in circuit we have of the radio transmitter we have components like uh, inductor capacitance and they have uh, impedance and bandwidth must be carefully controlled in order to to avoid any trouble with the FCC the Federal Communication Commi Commission so that we are having trouble because we know that we, our tank or the our resistor will have a tolerance of about 10 percent that means this value will be lie between the 25 plus or minus 6.25 ohms so we have wide range now being a designer we should be able to tackle this random tolerance variation in the circuit because this will cause a problem that's why B spice offers a Monte Carlo analysis now, during the Monte Carlo analysis, PSPI performs a run, AC, DC, and transient analysis every time varying the component value randomly with the, within the tolerance range. So, we will vary the component's value within the tolerance range and make a AC, DC, and transient analysis. Now, that's the simple circuit we have constructed with a tolerance of 25%. Now this is the Monte Carlo analysis and we got for the dB in a frequency spectrum and that's the I source for that this for the 25% tolerance that's V source by I source that's all the value of the curve we got we study the Monte Carlo analysis. Now we're gonna make a schematic for the Monte Carlo analysis. This is the circuit we're gonna form. Add the, add the one capacitance and two inductor and one source. We need a two induct one inductor, one resistance for the tank circuit, and this is the uh, connect all those components. Give the ground the common grounding to the three parallel lines. I can get three. This one will be the VDC V source voltage and R tank 10 volt AC 0 volt DC capacitance even is 0 0.0.1 0 .1 microfarad.ay R tank 25 ohms tolerance we gain 25 percent. Twenty-five percent display. Our tank twenty-five percent. Make it a common uh, ground thing. This is the tank circuit. We we study the Monte Carlo. Now we have activity. Now for the DB resource by divided by V put as the graph for the different values. Swipe it. Reserve for the various values of R. We give tolerance and I'll keep the cursor on that. This is all the minimum values. This is resource. Now we have to find the value so that we can have we find the value of 50 kilohertz for the various This is all the minimum values we got it. Tolerance, we can tolerance to ten percent.
for 10 percent and the output for we can see the minimum values now these are all the values we call for 10 percent now this is the peak values now that's the graph so we can see that The output file, you can see the minimum and the value and what value of frequency. Now, we will plot the graph of Do the Gaussian analysis and select the Gaussian instead of default uniform summarize. Now we will for output source by input source. So this is all the Gaussian analysis. We found that it's 7.87 percent. That's the values we got. 76 minus 70.19 divided by 76 for 70.90. The 76 and 70 point so starting and ending values. And from the graph. For the output values we got, this is the V source, 